We start in Evansville where an old rivalry between East and West was rekindled tonight at the Wrights Bowl. But as Eyewitness News Ryan Whitry explains, there was much more on the line than just bragging rights. Ryan? That's right, Brad. There's nothing like a classic rivalry, especially one at a stadium like the Wrights Bowl. But no matter what the final score tonight says, the real winner of tonight's game between Modern Day and Memorial was actually the St. Vincent de Paul Food Pantry. Clashes between Evansville's two Catholic high schools are always intense. And the fans were into it, no matter if they're West Side Wildcats or Memorial Tigers. But even as the schools fought on the field, their fans came together, uniting in a common purpose, raising money for the St. Vincent de Paul Food Pantry. Thank you. This is always a great atmosphere. It, you know, both the schools are very positive about this game, and we're so grateful to the Knights of Columbus, to the two high schools, and to all the feeder schools for their participation in this Hunger Bowl collection. For six years, the Knights of Columbus have collected donations at the game for the pantry, over $50,000 in fact, they say it just wouldn't be possible without the community support. Anything you say makes it sound like, you know, you're you're pumping up, your, you know, patting yourself on the back, but that's not the case. It's just that uh, the whole community has not let us down. And they've exceeded our expectations uh, over and over again. So... I, I really don't know what else to say besides that. Sister Donna Hur says the need for food in the community has continued to increase, and they're thrilled to see the help come their way. There are so many people in need, you know, at this time. Um, they're working, but they just don't make enough money to pay for all their bills plus food. So it's a great, uh, it's a great joy for me to see the schools come together and reach out to help those who are, who are in need. And despite the rivalry between these two schools, Bishop Joseph Siegel says the so-called Hunger Bowl connects to each school's core mission and purpose on a much deeper level than just a football game. Amen. Central part of our faith is sharing, helping our brothers and sisters in need, and I think this is an essential lesson of this uh, Hunger Bowl is to help. Uh, again, a football game is a wonderful time to come together, but to be able to provide for the needs and for the hungry, that is a lesson about what it means to be a follower of Christ, to be a Catholic. Bishop Siegel says he's really not much of a sports fan, but he's happy to see the two schools come together for an even bigger purpose. Ryan Wittry, Iowa News. All right, thank you, Ryan.